Ear. Ear, ear, ear. Hey. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Um, to to another, another episode of 570 five, oh, Live. Ah, thank you. You're so digital. Thank, thank you, guys. Thank, thank you. You, you like, you like my, my little intro, guys? guys? Your boy, boy stepping step the game, game up. Ooh, 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 ooh. Yeah. yeah. Alrighty. Alrighty. So, so, a lot, a lot of y'all already know LJ, LJ but if you don't, don't this is this LJ, aka John, aka Lil John. Little John. Like, like I said, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. AKA your auntie's favorite nephew. <laughs> AKA the new school. AKA J TV. Right? right? That's a new thing, right? No, I know. It's... Well, I thought, well, I thought you, you did that. Maybe I just did it on my No, you did that on X. You did that when you Yeah, I probably just acronymed it. But, uh, yeah, let me go. Oh, oh shit. Sorry. Sorry about that. Yeah, yeah I put, 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 popped, popped it up on my phone. phone. There's a lot, There's a lot of, of echo on my part. part. Hmm. Let's, Let's see. see. My mic, mic. Skype. Yo. Yo. Let me, let me know, know if it's uh, still echoing. echoing. Let's say, say something, something LJ. Make sure they can hear you, too. Let's see. We got, we got four, four people, people watching, watching right now. now. Hey, hey, what up, up Ali? Yeah, 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 I gotta make sure because I, I turned down the Skype one. one. I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure, sure I have to turn that up so I can so they can hear you. But, but my, my mic, I got, I got two, two things. things. Yo, I'm around my house. I ate like fucking like 19 blue zannies. I popped like five, and I was like, hey, you know what? I need to pop more. So then I popped like fucking. Like yeah, four years more. I never, I never like you saying ex bro like that. I woke up in her fucking. I woke up in her house and I was like, "What the fuck am I? What, what that crib up there by uh? Up in like the north side. Yeah, yeah by, by uh the plot, right? right? Yeah, that shit was. Could you, Could you hear, hear me? Am I still uh, uh echoey? echoey? Now they can't hear me. Yeah, yeah. No, I, I, know I turned yours back up. They should be able to hear you now. Okay, where? Yeah, I figured it wasn't that one. I'm echoing. Let me see. Ba, 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 ba. We, we love, love to see you smile. I had to tag RJ in there. He told me to, uh, told me to tag him. So I'm not gonna forget. Then I tagged him. Right? I still don't know. Why, why am I echoing? I'm, I'm old as hell, man. I don't, I don't see why I would be echoing. I have every. Oh, wait. I got you. No, no I, see I see why. I'm live on my phone, but I got it muted. I got it. No, I, I figured it out. I'm oblivious. I'm good now, right? Yes, sir. <laughs> it's because my mic, my oh, camera well, was that you, was bro. also picking up, and my microphone was picking up. He said, "I'm already here, biatch. <laughs> I'm good now. Hey, good looks, Uncanny. There we go. It's not echoing now, right? It shouldn't be now. We got two goods, one still echoing. Greggy, Greg in the building. Okay, I see you. He Greg. might be a little behind, but. Okay. We got 10 people already in. How about that? Now I'm good. Hey. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So what up, guys? How y'all doing today? Right. Good Friday, you know? Oh, yeah. I forgot for all you Catholics. Yeah, man. I'm, you know, that's how I was raised. I didn't eat no fucking... I can, I can eat fish, but I can't eat you no know, like, actual like meat today. Oh, word. I just ate some yeah. fried chicken. I don't even know. <laughs> <laughs> but I forgot. I'm not Catholic, but... I don't know, man. I, I, I sometimes want to uh, give up the the swine. I love it so much, but I know it's so bad for your body. It's like poison, you know what I mean? So Yeah, no, pork, yeah. No, I, I try to, I'm not even, I'm not even Muslim or anything like that, but I want to, um, I want to give that shit up. For I real? think every religion, I think every religion says some shit about pork. You shouldn't eat it. Oh, uh, yeah. Some, I way, think, some way, shape, or form. Yeah. yeah you shouldn't sure. eat it. Yeah, but, but people, uh, Most Europeans were traveling on boat. And that was the best way to keep uh, meat fresh, or the easiest meat to keep fresh was uh, swine, you know, pig. Because they can keep it, like, on a boat for mad long. So that's what they say. But what's up with y'all? Greg was good. Mike from Florida? Mike? My man talked like this. He be like, hey, yo, Vic. What you doing, Vic? I got yo. My man said, my man used to say dog after everything, bro. Right? Just like, yo, da da da, what up, dog? Uh uh, get give me a drink, dog. So one time a cat came in and he um he bought mad food for uh 
for like uh he just doing like a a picnic for everybody. You know what I'm saying? I don't know why that just beeped. But he was doing a picnic for like the mm-hmm. hood. We were gonna go to the park and a cat tried to eat at his chicken that he had like um seasoned and stuff. And he was like he went the cat came by and he was like Get the hell out of here, goddamn cat dog! And my ass started rolling, bro, because I was like, cat dog, and I was going, cat dog, right, boom, yeah. boom, 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 cat dog. You know what I mean? Uh, <laughs> that guy. Well, What's up, too. Mike? I ain't seen you in a minute. I hope you're doing good, bro. Hey, sis. Yeah, was, it's always fun when you find somebody from down south that has that deep accent. I remember back at um, uh, Jo's old spot over on fucking Kapowis. We used to get oh, people that just like randomly stumbled in. I know, right? And would like, like stay there for brief periods. And uh, you would let one them live there with them for a minute? Sometimes, yeah. The Jay one dude was there, so nice. The bro. one day uh, we asked him like, oh, what they call you? He was like, they call me Snug. <laughs> Snook? <laughs> yeah, Snug. Monday, S-N- Snug. <laughs> like Snug, but I guess he pronounced it Snug. Oh, yeah, because that's, that's how he talked. His accent, yeah. That shit. Man, I only partied there like a handful Right, of random times. ass people, for real. J.O. was always cool with me, even after that one situation with Corey. <laughs> oh, yeah, that, that was different, though. He was the one who gave us the permission. Do whatever yeah. you want. Corey, you're my dog. You can do whatever you want, bro. But, you know, that's in the past, you know. You know that... Let me know he's in here. Tag him just in case. Who? J.O. This shit was his oh, spot. Oh, That shit got... Yo... That's funny as shit, bro. I drove past that crib today. Yeah, you did I hit it with a past, cookie sheet. <laughs> I drove <laughs> past um, I drove past the old um studio. I was doing a, a grocery order on Boulevard. What? Oh, Boulevard. Word. Yeah, I know I it's so weird because that was the crib that you mostly yeah. came to out of like then, the studio. And then I delivered um on Theodore Street by Harv's old spot where we had the fucking wave video. That's crazy. Um, All three spots today. I don't know if you remember that. Yeah. We had that crazy ass fucking uh. Video the born winner shit. I wasn't there. The fucking party into a music video. I was definitely People in Florida. That shit was in the club. Yeah, I was definitely in Florida, bro. <laughs> Any of y'all was in that video that's watching this shit? I don't even remember that fucking night. It was like a fucking hundred something people. I barely remember that shit. I was a high as hell, geeked on Molly. Oh man, Hang yeah, up. bro. I did too much Molly in Florida. Shout out to Mike. Actually, Mike knows about that. Apparently we were pimps and we didn't even know. Yo, BA yeah. in the build was good. My God. What'd you just say? I said BA in the building. Oh. Ben. Talk about Ben? Oh, word. What up, yeah. Ben? Oh, you just look out back in the day, too. Word. I was going to uh, start it off with just saying, seeing what, you know, saying what up to everybody. Good. You know what I'm saying? Some weed, if I need, you know what I'm saying? Put me in a couple good positions. Good dude. That motherfucker always had some sunglasses and some money. <laughs> Consistently. Man. For real. I know, like, everybody from Townhouse, bro. Because I used to play basketball at Weston my, like, my whole life. So I know, like, all of them. Oh, I hear my daughter in the background. But yeah, it's a real nice day today. I didn't know it was going to be this nice today. Yeah, no, facts. We do, bro. It was real nice. Man. Definitely. But uh, I wanted to start it off with everybody who was on New Street back in the day. Clearly, no New Caesar. You know what I mean? Everybody had to have. If you were on New Street and you, even though he didn't live on New Street, he was always there and he was he was part of y'all crew. Yeah, know? he was he was there a lot too. He was on he was up on Madison. He wasn't that. Yeah, on, he was on he Maddie. Wasn't that far, so we was always just we was always just up going and down. back and forth and partying at the car wash. That's what, I remember that's we what got. Felt like. That whole hill section used to be bad. What? That whole hill section? Yeah, I I lived in that alleyway. You know, there was the hood. You know McKenna Court, the court that's right above Maddie. I used that's where I lived like a quarter of my life. It's like Madison's right here, and then you go up a little bit. There's a little alleyway in the back, Uh and uh, not not Caesar's alleyway, but up one more, and then that's the alleyway I lived on for like a lot of my life. I grew up there. That's where like. You ever heard of the gang A Dub? <laughs> it started in that. Yeah, alleyway. yeah. <laughs> I remember hearing about the shit. Facts. Yeah, but we I remember me and Will court. used to me and Will used to walk back and forth to the parties and shit. We would be like, "Yo, just keep walking, just keep walking, like, just, play, just keep walking." <laughs> I remember one time we, I think we had a keg for like Halloween or something there, for, at Caesars, and then we, uh, I think we got kicked out at what? It might not have been that party, but it was a party, and then we just all went over to the car wash and and, <laughs> and continued the party. 
<laughs> His parents oh, were yeah. having it that night. Yeah, that was. Uh, I think we blew something up that night too. Probably. Some shit like that. We blew up uh, the Kilo Monkey. I think. We always used to blow shit up though. Probably. Yeah, I don't Allie's, remember. Allie's in there too. I remember we blew up a fucking VCR in front of her house, and her neighbors did not like that shit at all. A VCR? We, What'd done, you put? Yeah. Dynamite or uh, a quarter yeah, stick? Yeah, maybe. Yeah, a quarter stick or some shit. Yeah. We've done worse shit there before too, but I guess that night they just wasn't having this shit. Man. We blew that shit to smithereens. But yeah, I just wanted to, uh, you know, shout them out and have a moment of silence real quick for C's, man. Rest in peace. I'll never forget that time, Definitely. man. Definitely. Miss you, bro. Word. Rest in peace, bro. You know, I remember... uh, Forever miss, bro. I remember last Energy never died either, you know? Facts. Energy never died. We all still think of him for sure, man. Ah, it sucks. So young, bro. 16. Yeah. Right? 16. Yeah. I remember he just came back from North Carolina. And mind you, he turned 16... On the 29th. Oh, the 29th he wasn't of even? July. Yeah, he turned 16 on the 29th oh, of July. Right. And then he, he passed on August 7th. Yeah. So he, was like, he, like, he like literally just turned 16. That is crazy, Fucking man. sucks, bro. He just came back from North Carolina, right? Or South yeah, Carolina? Yeah, South Carolina. Yeah, yeah. Literally just came back. We went to that party at Jay Bennett's house. I don't think he was back for two, three weeks. Three weeks tops. Yeah, he told you know me he got three back not long ago. Yeah. I was like, damn, man. Fucking I went, sucks, bro. Oh, that was a horrible, but, you know, he's in a, another place right now watching down on us, you know. Facts, bro. We used to get turned. That basement was litty, bro. We was teenagers partying like grown-ass men. I know, right? And they so wonder that, why half of us are so bad Yo, now. I'll never forget the day we all fucked up on Kalatapan, and we killed the keg at his basement. That's teenagers. Keg's gone. Oh, I think damn, I was there that one. It's me... No, I remember it was Who me. used to bring the um kegs? Tierney? No, it was somebody because none of we was fucking young. You know what I'm saying? Oh, there was like before that. Oh yeah, rest in peace Tierney yeah. too. Yeah, cool. Oh, yeah, damn. This guy's one. Think of that. Doing two Every together. time I pass this shit, yeah. You know, most of us wasn't even 18, let alone 21. So I forgot who the fuck. I'm was. your guys' age. Like I'm pretty yeah, sure you're my age. But yeah, I was a year yeah, up. Yeah. I'm, I'm 29 in November. That fucking yeah. that doorknob at 30 is like right there. You know, I keep getting closer and closer. I know, bro. But yeah, I remember the the one night, bro, we killed the keg at his crib. It was me, him, uh, me, Caesar, Big John, and Shad. <sighs> we fucking we killed the keg, and um, we're like, yo, fuck, let's go to the U. Yo, we go up to the U. I'm so fucked up. These dudes uh didn't intentionally leave me at the party. I guess we all just fucked up, and it's the way it happened. They left me at the same spot for like two hours. And then came back. They were looking for me and found me in the same spot, even drunker. Mm. But we got fucked up. We woke up. Caesar was in a completely different outfit. <laughs> didn't, know how, didn't know how or why. I woke up and I had um this <laughs> like a uh, Samsung Propel phone. That was like when smartphones were like uh Just came like out. coming up on the rise. Like it, yeah. it like it like slid up type shit and had the keyboard. Yeah, little like be... Green John I had. Bro, I woke up. That shit was disassembled. Like in a trail, like a scavenger hunt. Like <laughs> phone right here, back piece here, fucking battery over here. And I couldn't find my shoes and I woke up with a pair of shades on. We both <clears> woke up like, what the fuck? And another time I see the crib too, I remember I woke up. I woke up with, with Shad actually too. Or even though I had some weed on. He's like, we got Buckley, we got a roll up. Yeah. Boom, wanna throw in the weed to him and everything like that. Smoking all that shit. We go to leave Caesar's crib and I'm like, yo, these ain't my shoes. <laughs> Who's <laughs> these ain't my shoes? On? I guess I guess uh I guess me and Big John fucking switched shoes. Oh. Or some some crazy shit like that. That shit was fucking hilarious. <laughs> I looked down though, I'm like, yo, they ain't my they ain't my fucking shoes. I'm like, these ain't my fucking shoes that I had on last night. Fucking crazy nights there, bro. Yeah. Missed that shit. I'm glad I calmed the fuck down myself. Took a little while, but you yeah. know some got us... that shit out the way. Man, I remember I probably calmed down maybe like <clears throat> when I turned like 22, that was probably when I was like, "All right, bro." Yeah, I caught that case that opened up a lot. Yeah, but well, that shit could have been a lot worse in my favor. I just got, I just got lucky. Yeah, you're. That right. my folks trying. It was to... your first big case too, so. Yeah, they was trying to fucking, not necessarily. How roof long did me, you but... do in county over that? I didn't even have to. I didn't even have to do much. I had to do uh, two and a half months, but then when I came out, I had to serve the rest of the time on the street and did uh, six and a half months of uh, house, house arrest. arrest. 
and then uh, nine months of parole after it. <laughs> That's not bad but at I, all. What, I, bro? I did more yeah. time for punching yeah. someone for calling me yeah. a race, <clears throat> being racist to me. Well, they, well, they they fucked me on my they fucked me like on my um they they basically <laughs> fucked me on the back end because my uh, my uh, my lawyer. They they sent the dumb they sent the wrong motherfucker there. They didn't send John O'Brien. They sent Joe O'Brien to fucking court. So that dude was probably like, "What the fuck?" And I'm trying to tell them like, "Yo, I have court today." And they're making me seem like I'm flipping out and going crazy. I'm like, "Yo, I got court today." So you had to wait anyway, an extra week. No, my lawyer he did it. He did everything basically for me. And the first plea they bought, I didn't want to take it because they wanted me to plead guilty to two felonies. Oh hell They wanted me to no. get the position with intent to deliver. You had a good lawyer want, then because and they wanted somewhat yeah. And another then, um, lawyer would have been like, "Just take but, it. Just take no. it." No. And then a uh, uh, criminal use of communication facility because I got caught with four cell phones. So they wanted my ass to take a charge for one of them. And I was like, yo, I'm not doing that. So the only deal I could do, I had to get a, I got a felony too. But even though it was one felony, the judge said, no matter what, we're still giving him a gravity score of three, even though he's pleading guilty to one. So it's like I pled guilty to three, but only pleading guilty to one. Yeah, but only one's going to be. That's but that's BS anyway, because, you know, if they look yeah. up your case, they can still see all that. Yeah, it's, it's BS. Dumb. That's a common wealth for you, though, bro. For mad jobs, mad jobs from that shit. Yeah. Even with the the CDL shit, even with the CDL jobs, a couple of them denied me. You know they need fucking truckers everywhere. Yeah, literally bro. every fucking grandma needs a trucker, uncle needs one. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Fucking Walmart needs one. Every yeah, everything. You know they don't they don't give a fuck. Everybody needs this shit. It's so bad they're teaching them motherfuckers how to drive themselves. They're like fuck the employee. We're just gonna make that shit drive itself. Yeah, but. Ain't like, what was I saying? What we what we start off talking about that? We were talking about we were talking about Caesar. We had a moment of silence. We were talking about um yeah, about that, that shit. the last thing we just spoke about. Hmm. I don't know. I can't remember. But yeah, I don't even remember how we met each other. How the heck? When did we even meet each other? Do you remember? Uh, uh, uh I I think it was uh, I think it was at Caesar's prison. Might have been. In the so what, I knew Caesar first. Most likely. Mm, I don't even know. I don't remember. All Most I remember likely. is I, I one of the first times I remember you, but I didn't hang out with you at that time, was uh, when there was a fight at the bus stop. And um, you went to go punch somebody and the lighter flew out your hand. <laughs> remember it was oh, that kid Najee or something? Oh, yeah. He was I remember fighting that, that, like, shit. That, that country no, kid that was like racist. No, he was no, like me and him. <laughs> no, we, we all we all skipped school and decided to drink a half gallon of Blue Wave. <laughs> yeah, that's between it, that's like it. like five teenagers. Exactly. So we get we all get <clears throat> fucked up and then we go to Square and High and supposedly um some kid was supposed to like uh some kid was supposed to like hit like Mike McHugh's sister or was going to or some shit like that and then some whole some whole other shit fucking <laughs> happened out of it. Fucking uh Jimmy uh Jay was cousin he was fighting some dude. I came out of nowhere with a lighter in my hand, hit somebody, lighter yeah, goes flying. That's all I remember. And then, uh, fuck, I forgot his last name. I just added a. I think it was a blue just, lighter, uh, too. I just added him on Facebook, too, where he added me. Some the kid you like hit? Fucking, uh, no, 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 Josh. Um, forgot his fucking last name. He had like a, a throwback in the day, too. Yo, we look over. We're like, yo, who is he? <laughs> he, just, he just out of all nowhere. All I knew is I was watching. I was laughing. Uh, ever since that day, I, I always fucked with dude. You know, he was, he was a good dude. But we're like, yo, till this day, I still don't know who the fuck he was putting hands on. But <laughs> he was, he, he got somebody. Yeah. Yo, yo, what the fuck happened? That shit was, that shit was wild. Yeah. I remember I, I went to go um, run. Officer Mike tried to break this shit up. That was yeah, but there's high. way too much people. I go to I go to fucking run. I fell in a fucking ditch. Got back up and still started limping away. That tells you he really wasn't serious. Like he he wasn't even. He just wanted to pretend like he was doing his job because there's if he wanted to catch my fat ass, he would have. Yeah, you know what I'm sure. saying. Oh, yeah, I, I remember you running because you were I holding your pants up and taking yeah, off. You were running like. Yeah. Oh yeah, I was slow. <laughs> like a penguin. I was slow <laughs> and and fell in the ditch. Oh man, and then God. got back up. You can't run with saggy pants. Nah. It just doesn't work, people. If you're, drunk. Crime, if you're committing crimes, you're getting in the fights, pull them up. Just pull them up. That's it. But yeah. Or have, have, the first have, time active wear underneath. have some active wear underneath to take off. Don't commit crimes in baggy pants. Yeah, I think you were in like Dickies or something, bro. Uh, yeah, I, from scratch. I honestly, I'm pretty I sure you're in Dickies because you were supposed to go yo, to school and you didn't go to school. Yo, I can, yeah, I consistently wore a Dickie suit for like two years straight. I had the the button down dicky shirt and yeah. I had the shorts, the pants. Looking I had like a L.A. gangbanger. Literally, basically, yeah. You know what? Because fucking tech, 
Yeah, Hackle of course. Shit. That's how he was wearing. So I was like, yeah. that's my dude. So that's what, what I'm wearing. Brown dickies? Hell I remember, to the B-side. Well, can't people thought, um, kill the city. Kill people thought I was like gang affiliated and were trying to rep some shit because I had... um. What, they thought you were a juggalo? They were like, whoa, they, whoa. They, yeah, uh, I wore red and black a lot, but I had um. The game oh, yeah, they definitely thought you were a yeah, JRB, right? The game, no, no. Or the, blood? The game, basically, yeah. Blood, yeah, they, the game came out with the hurricane. Oh, back of course, in, yeah. Those sneakers, and um, I had one. Rap I, name. I had I had them laced, like checkered laced, and the left shoe was black and the right shoe was red. So they're like, he's a blood. Yeah, they're like, what the fuck? I was like, nah, I'm just doing this, you know? Snap, so Kirk no in Kansas City. I had no idea what the shit meant at the time. What happened? I had no idea what the shit meant at the time. I was just trying oh, to... Oh, yeah. Trying to... We can't wear a lot of things. Like, if you go to L.A., you can't wear, like, a lot. Like, the, your hat means something. That's brim, usually. My hat, but n- not this one. But if you wear a KC uh, Royals hat, that's Kitchen kitchen Crip. You know what I mean? So you can't wear a lot of things if you go to, like, Cali and stuff. Like, most places on the East Coast aren't, like, very, like that political. Everything came from Cali anyway, you know what I mean? So it's, like, super political over there, bro. You can't, you can't wear damn near anything. But, uh, yeah, man, when are you supposed to be dropping the track that we're on? I know you're supposed to be um, sent to me. Oh, I'm probably gonna try to drop it all over the weekend. If not, maybe oh, wait. start next week. Yeah. You didn't set it for a certain date. No, I, I set I set it on DistroKit for the 13th, but it's still on waiting to get it uploaded to uh, stores and shit like that. Oh, you try to do it on the 13th? Oh, it'll yeah, be yeah. it'll be posted in a couple of days. It might. Yeah. It'll send I'm, you still, a link. I'm still gonna put it on YouTube regardless. I would do it now it like before that. you, because yeah. it might mess with you and try to copyright yourself. Like I get copyrights constantly on my Instagram because like I have my music all on yourself. Yeah, and then like they mm. try to say, "Oh, this is copyrighted." And I'm like, "Bro, I'm me. How many times do I gotta write this to them?" Like, bro, nah, every me, time. me and uh, me and uh, me and Vic, we gotta we gotta track together. Shit called Lottie Dottie Da. It's Lottie a good Lottie track. Da. Oh, what up, Dom? What up, Taj? What up, Shane? What up, Tim? So- oh, I haven't seen Tim in Mad Long. You know Tim, right? Timmy? So Black Tim? Yeah. Yeah, Salisbury, yeah, of yeah, course. Yeah, of course. Crazy, bro. Yeah, he, hell yeah. The, I remember the one truck time, guru himself. I went on a blunt ride with him, and he was like, oh my God, bro. It was like me, him, I think Melissa O'Neill, and I think maybe Corey. And uh, Tim was driving like a psychopath, bro. Just laughing the whole time. Laughing, and I'm like, "Yo, you are." I was like, "I just, I remember just wanting to get out the car." I'm like, "Son, I, I'm terrified." <laughs> and he'd just be laughing, <laughs> laughing high as hell. No, Tim was always, he was always good vibes. Yeah, he's good people. That's how you know it was a good party. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> if he was there. Oh yeah. Yeah. I can't remember the last. It was night. it wasn't a boring night. It wasn't like a drama filled like ratchet ass night. It was like a it was always like a good night. He was like he was always he was always there at the right time. He was like word. Word. Was word. Good party. What up, Dante? Cafe. You're Ah man. It's twenty four seven. Well this is twenty four seven. What's twenty four seven? Um Oh Tim. Oh word. The vibes. Let's see. Why well, are you doing this trucking thing too? Yeah, I thought you were gonna drop an of... album though. I thought you said you were gonna drop your album soon. Yeah, no, not not as soon as I thought. <laughs> it's hard when you're doing everything yourself. Turns out. Yeah, and believe then, me, I know. Shit I know. just got dark as hell. Yeah, your background did just get really dark. Yeah, I'm, let me turn the light on. I was using a natural light. What's me, your uh... team? You're not. You're a Celtics fan. Yeah. I thought so. I was like, that's what I put in my notes. Music, sports, right and I'm I put... i turn my fucking light on. Oh, go ahead. How did it go off? How'd your light just go off? There we go. What What just happened, though? Wasn't it light before that? I don't know what the fuck happened there. It was or some... was the sun out and it was like No, out. it was the, the the sun. The sun was just like, yo, fuck you and your podcast. <laughs> but yeah, there we go. But yeah, I put down yeah. next to sports. I said our, uh, something about us arguing because I, I, I'm guessing it's because you're a Celtics fan. I'm a Lakers fan. <laughs> Celtics oh, yeah. are actually I, all right right now. Like, yeah, honestly, they've been, they, they've been pretty consistent I the past the, couple years. I think they're the first seed in the Eastern Conference right now. Word think so i don't know i haven't been keeping up ever since the lakers fell out so 
I can't yeah, tell you. I'm I'm upset with what they did. You know what? They had every everyone together and everything like that. Made like the craziest super team ever, and it was just who the Lakers. I was, yeah, but the results bro. just weren't there. Nah, bro. I already said the super teams were gonna weren't gonna work out that much. It's not even like, that. Look, like look at the Suns and the Bucks that went to the fucking finals last year. You know what I'm saying? What they had good players there, but. They had mad young players and you it's know a couple all stars. Well, the Bucks, these other teams, they have all all stars. Bucks have damn near all star team. Drew Holiday. Oh yeah, now yeah, now yeah. You know what I mean? Giannis, uh, Brooke yeah, Lopez, um, monster. Bobby Portis, uh, De- what's his name? That Italian dude, Defen- DiVincenzo. He's nice, but he was actually injured. And then who's his- oh and um, uh, Chris Middleton. Their whole team's pretty good, man. Yo, yo Middleton. Middleton was that, probably the one of the most. In, he's one of the most improved players. Yo, he's I've seen like in the past years. He just came out the cut with that shit. And nah, he, just, he was always pretty he good. But he, for a Not second like round that. pick, yeah, you're right. Yeah. He wasn't giving him the, the ball in the last seconds like yo pop he that. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> now he started making them yeah, for real. Definitely. Mm. Drew definitely Holiday coming player. definitely helped him because yeah, they had to start Drew paying attention to Drew anywhere he went to. Huh? He was always good everywhere he went to. He, he was good on the Pelicans, too, for a minute. Yeah, he's been he wasn't around. wasn't bad there, too. He was one of those people you could put anywhere, you know? Yeah. Kind of could throw him with every team, and he'll be all right. He was with the... Uh, the first, he was drafted to the Sixers. Then he went to the Pelicans. Then he went to... Yeah. Yeah, that's what happened. He's still kind of young. But he's, he's really good on both sides of the ball. You know what I mean? Let me see what everyone's saying. If everyone... Where we're at... People in the building, you know. Yeah. I know it's a Friday. A lot of people, uh... A lot of people, uh... <laughs> out trying to do stuff. Yeah, Easter coming up. You know, everyone's gonna... Everyone's gonna get fly and shit. I know, right? And everyone's gonna... Right. Pull out the... Pull out the, the pink suits and the... And the... The, the oh, casual man. dress and shit. I look like I'm, uh... Bitches gonna start putting We're on bunny ears. A little Make people forget right their now. hose. I don't know what's going on. Come on. Yeah, it's starting to like the stream's messing up a little bit. Uh oh. Yeah, I don't want to have to redo it. Let me see if I could do anything right now to kind of save it. You got this, Doc. Doctor Vic. For real. Try. Perform surgery. You guys can't see what I'm seeing too. I see Vic's screen. This dude is doing a bunch of shit that I don't know what the fuck to do. <laughs> I'm trying, man. I'm trying to see some engineer shit. Let's see if that helps. Yeah, it helped. Hey, I just saved it. My bad, we y'all. Go. We're good. We're good. It's a little less quality, but but yeah, bro. I'm about to drop another album. I don't know, man. Like it, it take like. It's hard for me to sometimes wake up and feel like inspired, bro. When you're dealing with kids and like, you know, right. rap. You know what I'm saying? Like it's hard sometimes to write music when you're like. Thankfully, not, I got everything. I got shit like you know. I got shit recorded. Yeah, shit I have mad songs in the cut. Ready. But it, I have everything. I have everything in a folder, but. It's, it's hard doing everything your fucking it's self, It's still dude. different, man. Oh yeah, of course. Producing and doing everything yourself is real. Yeah, hard, it's man. it's like building. It's like building the the restaurant you're trying to manage. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And being the only worker there. You know, it's like you know something's got to give. It takes so much longer. Yeah, for real. When I was just fucking. When I was just like snagging beats off YouTube and didn't even give a fuck about a hook and just I know, rapping. Right? Like, like back in the day, we could make a mixtape day type shit, and now. You know, I want to focus more on, you know, I want to, I want to be able to sell the shit. You know what I'm saying? So I want to I want to take more time into the shit. Not saying people wouldn't fuck with it if, it, you know, it was still like a that. But, you know, like that things have changed. You know, you know I, want, I want to make money off this exactly. shit now. That's the goal. It's a whole different you know, hobby, hobby world cool, when you want to you know, treat it like a job. Right, yeah. You know what I'm saying? You got to start like... I'm mad I fell off, man. I, I love making fucking music. I you know, know that right? shit. You used to make me. so much music back in the day. Yeah. Me and you it have at least something. what? On my SoundCloud, I think I have like four tracks with you. Yeah, I haven't uploaded was, in SoundCloud than, in pff, so long. Close bro. to five, close to five, maybe less than ten, somewhere around there. Yeah, like between like five, five or ten. The first song I think I mean, oh, oh, we had was, was the old studio. Yeah, but was it like ten? 
just in this crib there was like five, so yeah. it might even be more. Because we lost, I lost like there was like sixty songs I did back at that old studio. What Joe? That never, yeah, that I, I'll probably never, never see or hear again. There was a bunch of shit we had on there. Yeah, but the, um, that's right. I'm so, you're saying studio your tracks, went, yeah. Yeah, the lab, the laptop went with that shit too. Yeah, that's Bro, I remember true. that shit. I started um, like literally like fifty like seventy five dollars. Will sold me um a laptop he got from his aunt that fixed it or some shit like that. That was like fifty dollars. I bought a fucking a USB microphone that was like a handheld like regular like rock the stage type mic. Yeah, and a pop catcher. I had to put that shit into the computer. Wrap that shit around the bar on the clothes rack in my closet, and then put the pop catcher on that bitch and call it a studio. <laughs> but that shit worked though, you know what I'm saying? That's where you first started recording. Like, yeah. Oh, where my first started recording by myself because I wouldn't, I didn't know how to record without D-Lo back in the day. Yeah. It wasn't for D-Lo. I would have no idea what the fuck to do. So that was like I'm the first time I had to record my own shit. That shit was crazy. What was the first studio? Oh, we made a studio. My first studio was my brother-in-law's. He got uh, a microphone. It's a cardboard box. Yo, it was good, BJ. I see you. Oh yeah, Beaker. He's finally in. Oh yeah. Well yeah. Well yeah. Will's right. The cardboard box. Remember that shit? That studio at um, at uh, I don't. You guys call it Joe's. I call it Mars. But I didn't roam like that. But at, um, that uh. Oh yeah. Uh, you Mar- never really met Joe because he was in jail was by the fucking, time you uh. Remember that shit? It was a uh, that shit said Lowe's like something on it. it was, like, oh Washington yeah, the State one that we made up there. Box, That's yeah. Right. I forgot. That shit was lit that. though. Yeah, it that worked shit was well. Hot as hell. Literally got hot as hell in that motherfucker. His He's about crib, to pass out. His crib before Yo, remember that, one though, day? we had he had the ill. He foamed the whole closet, bro. It was fire. Mm. Yeah, it was nice. Yo, remember that one song? You, I don't know what song it was, but we was taking so much Molly, and we was staying up for so long <laughs> that you had mad cotton mouth. And we had yeah, to keep on recording that shit. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> because I hear that shit in the, in the background. Oh, that's, uh, you're talking yeah. about the track that I have with, uh, I think B's on it. Is it me? Me and B? I think so. I don't even think I was on this shit. But I was like, yeah, oh. what was you it? had to re record that shit like 10, 15 times because your lips kept on smacking. Yeah. Too much Oh, that's that Molly that. Fuck dollar, up. Do- I did the hook. Dollar, dollar, dollar. Man, it cost to be a baller. Got a leash on your bitch. Ain't no need to get a collar. 43 blunts of sour bud. Hit like Pala Mala. Yeah, that track. Yo, that track was fire. <laughs> We're Yo, supposed to Jose get in the on building. It. Who? What's good, man? Long time no see. Who'd you say? Jose. Oh, Lara. Oh, Lara. That's yeah, that, yeah, of that's course. That's that pinche vato loco. Oh, eh? shit. Well, uh, the, the comment, Will put door, better go explore. Uh, I wrote I wrote a verse for Will. It was a pretty decent verse, too, but yeah, that, that, was, all, all the time. that was part of the shit. I was like, get lost, boy, door in Diego, but... He was like, get lost, boy. Go to Indiego. Like, go not... to Indiego. Like, yeah, I was like, that's not. Like, bro, that's, like, that's... not even. Yeah, yeah. Like, it wasn't it. Oh, oh man, was I wrote I wrote this one bar for Corey, or this one song. Yeah, I think you were supposed to be on it, but Rel ended up being on it. And uh, well, how did it go? Corey's verse was fire on it. He, ra- he actually took it and made it his own thing. How did it go, man? Ah, oh. Damn. I just remember something about so much robot. I'm no baker, huh? Tell you shorty coming, but yeah, Corey killed it, yo. Corey had his own swag, even though you had to write his bars. He, did. he was nice. He did. He did. <laughs> yo, me and him, we did a song. It was called "Go Home." Go. Home. It was like a R and B style type shit. I wrote a crazy ass verse for myself, mm-hmm. and I even wrote just as good of a verse, if not better, for him. And we we killed that shit. I was like the first, my first chance. Uh, my first time trying to do an R and B joint. Oh, we killed that shit though too. Where I just found a song that I uh, that I just posted on my page that's like an R and B of me back in the day. And I'm Yo, like, the STLG shit, bro. We made we made a lot yeah. of fucking music. Oh, that's bro. the name. That was the song because yeah. you were supposed to be on it. They ask me just how I get it. The sky is just the limit. They ask me just how I get it. Yeah, you were supposed to be on it, but Corey. Yeah, ended I remember. Up, yeah, well, it was sky. Sky. That limit. was literally yeah, the name of the song. Was yeah. sky is the limit. <laughs> it was. Who was it? I think it was me. I think it was me. Uh, me, you, your brother, and Rel. Uh, right. What? Originally. Not. Oh, sky's the limit. Yeah. Yeah, I think originally. Well, I don't even yeah. know if I was originally in it. I think I just came and just like asserted myself in it. <laughs> I'm not gonna front though. I'm using kind of peaked allowed. a little bit more when we started that uh when that born winter shit started. It just it just started yeah, getting more recognition. Here. I was yeah, it started started getting more recognition. I think you just cause, you know what we were out at the fucking parties promoting it too. Yeah, so that was a different we already thing. we already had the people. It was different. We weren't in like 
we didn't, we weren't waiting for the people to come to the music. We was like, we took like a different approach and we bought that shit to them. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Shout out to Black. He looked out for he looked out for that. Yeah. He was definitely uh, it was everywhere. That wave party, bro, was the fucking like highlight. Yo, the we literally the city got turned upside down from that shit. Like, That's there's you fun. know what I'm saying. The bitch never messaged me. You know what I'm saying? They was fucking messaging me what's going on tonight. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> and shit like that. For at least you know for a couple of days, That's I was like, oh word. I felt word. felt lit. Felt like a celebrity, you know what I'm saying? I'll go place. Oh, you're the guy from the video. I used to get shit like, oh, you were the video. guy. You were the guy that was passed out in in Caesar's house. We got the picture in school. Oh yeah, you're on the the black and the purple shirt that we thought was dead in the bathroom. Oh, what's up, man? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Uh, I was gonna remember for more like positive shit instead of just being <laughs> fucked up at the party or selling somebody drugs or some shit or getting like high with them. People were like, oh, yo, I saw you on this video. You know what I'm saying? Oh, blah blah blah. Your music yeah. and shit like like word. It felt like good. progress. Progress. Oh, you're right. Honestly, to know people from something positive, yeah. to something always fucking negative. That's how I know most people. I either got high with them, I got them, them high. You know, what yeah. I'm saying? Some, yeah, I know a lot of something. people from selling them bud. That's how I know a lot of people selling bud. Yeah, that was the, you know how like uh, the friendly neighborhood Spider Man. I was like the friendly neighborhood Weed Man. That's I was, how I was too. I was like, I was like everywhere, bro. I was, the beef and broccoli. I was in the clutch. Boop, boop. I had like fucking five dollars to like a hundred and something. I Literally, know. I didn't. I had it, had it all. I started off with forty. Was... Me and Corey started off with forty dollars from uh, his McDonald's paycheck. Flipped that to like to a quap. It was nice. Well, oh man. yeah, I remember that. That's when y'all y'all was fucking selling weed across the yeah, street. Yeah, because that was because I, I was like, oh, these and then I switched fucking... to the, the that was gas. a nice crib though. It was a nice crib. What crib? Oh, our crib that we our first crib. Yeah, that was nice. Yeah. Oh yeah, Will's right that uh. I had a R and B John fucking just the weekend. I lost that shit, bro. The weekend, I oh, auto tune yeah. the shit, crazy shit. It was actually good too. It wasn't bad. People even know that shit was me. I had that shit on my first mixtape. It's the weekend. We could be friends. That's oh, you a... remember that shit? Yeah, of course I remember it, <laughs> <Word>. dog. <laughs> Word. I like the one track we did uh back in the day. What was it? Uh, I was like, ah, oh, how'd it go? You're like, have them slumped on the curb, shug night. Oh. It's a good night. Paper you're, chasing. Yeah, paper your chick chasing. scared of the dick, but in a good way. Yo, I was, that was the first song where I was like, yo, L went in on that, bro. Where I was like, yeah, my yeah, man that was, getting. That was paper chasing. Yeah. How did, I was paper chasing or some yeah, shit like that. something like that. It's still on my like, SoundCloud. Facts. Like, no, we going hard and it's never oh, yeah, going to stop. Oh, yeah, Got to get the clock. Got to, got to. Yeah, that shit was fire. Yeah, because I was like, yo, L, you say it. And you're like, say, what do you mean? And you're like, gotta get that guap. Got, gotta get that guap. Uh, gotta get that guap. Yeah, that was. Word. Bro, I, I was like the hook king at uh, Joey's. I was, I was like, yo, let me do the hook. I got it. I'll just do the hook. I got you. Oh, I remember that shit. Yeah, I gotta get this money clean or dirty. It's me from Jersey. Yeah. Sweet, like her. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, word. I was like, get it, spin it. Don't regret it. If it's about money, you know I fuck with it. <laughs> Yeah, that was my jam, man. We definitely did mad songs back then. I was like the king. Oh, dang. I hear myself. Yeah, no, I got, I got it on the live, too, so I can uh, see. Because I can't see. I can't yo, see what's on. More energetic up in here. I can't what's see up, what's everybody? Uh, going on. Keith. Hey. What up, Keith? I Yo, I was. I seen somebody that reminded me of him the other day. I was like, yo, Keith. But it was some random other guy. But I, I was at the park. And it looked just like him with a kid. And I was like, damn, that looks just like Keith. <laughs> Yo, what's up, Keith? Yeah, I, mean, I haven't yeah. seen him in a minute, man. I think the last time I heard, I think he was like living in Carbondale or something like that. I was like, man, I ain't seen him in a grip. I tried to pay attention would, to people. That motherfucker would drive like five minutes and come back with a car full of bitches. He used to like, <laughs> pluck, he used to like pluck them out the he grass. He actually sat at my, uh, oh, yeah, come, he here. Sat there come here, too. come here. Didn't you sit at our kitchen yeah, table? Our kitchen table. Our, our lunch yeah, table? Yeah, yeah, I was one of them. I was, I was, the, I was the odd one out. And, Me, uh, you. I, yeah. Was Pranoff too? No, no, he, he wasn't there. I, oh, shit, I remember. Yeah, it was me, you, Keith was there. Yeah, because um, that was when they, they they ended up fighting. But yeah, uh -huh. they were... Uh, uh, Jess Simmons was at the table, too. Oh, yeah, and Sierra yeah. Simon. Some, some, um, some, small um, girls. Sierra small that Damien kid. Damien, that Damien Rooney, kid. yeah. Oh, Ch Charlie was and at her Cody, table, too. Cody, Cody Roxby. Char Charlie was at her table, too, remember? Oh, yeah, Charlie, facts. Yeah, yeah, he was, he was at her table, too. That was a kind of lit table, too. We had, like, a oh, really yeah. diverse table. You know what I'm saying? We had, we had, like, different ethnicities, different, different heights, different colors. My sister shapes, was sizes. there, I think, too, actually. Sure. 
Boy, that was back in the day. I remember um I remember during lunch I used to uh, ask uh, Stephanie if she could fucking steal me chicken patties. Stephanie. You know, just to look out. Uh Schultz. Oh yeah, Think? yeah, yeah, yeah. She just always let me fucking put a fucking chicken patty in the purse. Them <laughs> shit was expensive, man. Yeah, I was Corey fucked used up, to always you know steal saying? mad chicken yeah, patties. I, had, I wasn't wasn't selling Adderall or weed in school. I didn't have no fucking you know, I didn't have no money there. Yeah, I feel like fucking that. 50 cents a dollar for a milk, 150 for a chicken I patty. Know, Fuck right? that. I still right in the pocket. Right yeah, I used first. to put the milk in my pan pocket and then walk right. out, have like three milk. That's when I think somebody at that table put me onto the uh, the pizza with the ranch sauce. I thought it was the most disgusting thing ever, That's but a... somebody put me onto this Corey shit. Corey do that all the time. And I was like, I was like, okay, I was like, okay, I'll try this. It actually, wasn't Here. bad. What up, killer? Killer, killer. Word, man. Let me see if I got any more notes on what to talk about before we completely wing it. <laughs> yeah, it worked. Cause I didn't. I didn't. I came unprepared. Oh, uh, it's dark again for your boy. Yeah, what happened again? <laughs> I don't know. It's my dark side. Welcome to the dark side of the force. Yeah, th- this is it, people. That's the that's the light I got. Today was a hard day for me, though. I talked to you yeah, about it before. I'll, maybe I'll look better. You know. Sucks, man. You see all the features. I look Spanish now because this shit's dark. Look, Hispanic homes. <laughs> what up, Vato Loco? Dang, BJ must be bored because I don't even see him commenting. He usually comments a lot. No, no one he, really he said something. He said, he said what up? Cheese pretzels? Facts. The cheese pretzels from Northeast was on fire, but Jose is right. Them spicy chicken patties at Scranton High. Them shits was amazing. I like the breakfast, bro. They had and that wasn't bacon breakfast pizza. Those rich kids always used to buy them first. Motherfuckers. What, the the spicy one? The, the spicy one. Yeah, they didn't put that many out compared to the regular ones. Really? They didn't make like, like five to one, you know? Yeah, I ate once in a while. Five regular for one spicy. Yeah. That's what... That's when the stereotype of high school lunch kind of got thrown out the window sometimes because some of that shit there was lit. You know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah, for real. That's what I was saying. The breakfast uh, pizza they had? You know, I'm a big deal. You know, it was my favorite subject. You know what I'm saying? Lunch was always my favorite subject. (laughs) Mine was history. (laughs) Or that and Earth and Space Science. I remember being high as fuck in Mr. K's class. I would miss like an entire week, come in there, blitz, and get 100 on the quiz. I was like, what the fuck? Did you cheat? Mr. K, I don't even know who that is. You know, I was like, you know, that's what happens when you watch Discovery and National Geographic when you're high, <laughs> when you're high at like 14. That shit just gets sunk into your head when you fall asleep on the couch with Discovery Channel on. It's like Dexter, while well, I'm let do fromage. Remember that shit? Yeah. I only fell asleep to the French uh, word. I didn't wait. Just... You took a um, you took a, um Spanish in high school. Or what'd you take? Uh, no, I didn't get um. I didn't have any language. Yeah, I didn't have I, one either. I did art, and I forget what else. I don't know. I was, I I was, oh, and photography. I was, in the, I was in the special classes. I don't even know if I could speak English. <laughs> they, had, they had me in the special classes. They're like, My hey, uh, in there yeah, everyone's going to take the test, and they're like, uh, you know, you special kids, come with us. You're going to go into the room. Oh, the resource room. The resource. Man, that shit. <laughs> Speaking of Cody like, Roxby, he just came in. I need in. help. <laughs> Yo, I need help. Yo, I need help. Fucking 15 questions or 15 hand raises. I need help. Oh, I need help. Me right yeah. here. Honestly, I didn't all the time. I, I was more like behavior and like my ADHD put me in there yeah, more. So up, I was Josh? like, I was like, I was like king. I was like king of the slow kids. So I kind of felt like the shit. But I, I, I was still in there though. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I was still the slow in. kid. Yeah, I was, man. I was. It was like slow king. King oh, slow. Man. That's horrible. <laughs> slow. Yeah, I did. Have, I still have curly hair, dog. It's just long, bro. I just be brushing it all the time. So I straightened out. Well, said so I had two multiple choice questions. You damn right, and I still ask for help. <laughs> like, I don't, I don't get it. Yeah. Oh yeah, they used to get, they used to make it so it was only like uh, three answers instead of four, right? right. Yeah, they, they, we we had modified tests. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah. Sometimes, for the most part. Oh man, high Word. school. I was like in the middle. Like I wasn't a very popular kid, but I definitely I was cool with everybody. I didn't really see things like that because when I started selling weed, <laughs> I sold it to everybody. That's what's a good thing about me is I can get along with everybody. You know what I'm saying? So I wouldn't yeah. really say I was like a super popular kid though, but I did hang out with a lot of them. If you consider them, like the Manuka kids were all really popular, and like I used to hang out with them. But like I wasn't like a part of them. You know what I mean? Like I did right. my own thing, and I was. In my own thing. I never tried too hard to be a part of them. I never, like, I always thought, like, 
I'm not gonna try to be something I'm not, bro. I'm not this preppy white kid that has a lot, like, you know what I'm saying? I'm not talking about saying that they're bad. I'm just saying I just wasn't that. You know what I mean? And half no, of them, fast, yeah. <laughs> they're crazy, bro. Yeah, I was, I was the oddball. Shout out to I was all, like, weird. Man. I just I hung out with a little bit of everybody. That Diskin and freaking Justin aren't here yeah, anymore, man. That, that, was, that was, was crazy. Horrible. I know, like, this come from, like, the parties and shit like that. Like, even back in, like, in Caesar's, like, Caesar's crib days, I remember, like, from that. They, like, I didn't chill with him too, too much. But they Justin came Willett, I, I chilled out with him. Yeah. Oh, that's I how I met that. him. That's how I met him. Oh, wow. He was coming through Caesar's crib, yeah. Wow, maybe I, I met them back Justin then, too, too, but I didn't know. Yo, I remember me and Justin, we uh we skipped fucking, listen, we were terrible. We were skipping summer school from skipping school. You know, originally, they get put into summer school. Y'all so. were skipping the school yeah. that you needed to make right. up. Oh, my God. Right, what up, that's... Justin? Yo, we went to... Uh, 727, hey, hey. We went or to fucking... Ho- holiday. Um, we went to Walgreens and tried our hardest to fucking steal from there. Stealing from Walgreens is not like stealing from the corner store. That shit is... Oh, yeah, a lot it hard. is really different. You know Everything's what I'm saying? It's locked a lot hard. up, too. Yeah, everything's <laughs> like... They, the motherfuckers like the time we went to the open. park. Remember the time yeah. we went to the park? <laughs> Corey, you're crazy, Corey. Remember I was talking- Oh shit on the duster? <laughs> yeah, that was crazy. Oh yeah, God. you was talking you was talking to Cassie yeah. like, yo, Corey, Corey you tricky. you're stupid. <laughs> <laughs> She's like, I'm Cassie, Victor. I'm like, Corey, yeah. shut up. <laughs> That shit was funny. Oh man, that duster will fuck you up. I think I still got damage from oh, that. Oh man, I never did it that much. I did it a few times, but oh no. Oh no, bro. bro, we was. I'm not promoting man. none of that. I don't do any drugs now. <laughs> Yo, we used to. We motherfuckers had the brake parts cleaner, bro. We upgraded from from gas to. Whatever the fuck it was, we oh. had brake parts cleaner in a brown paper bag, oh bro. My, I never did none that of that. That shit oh my was... God. That like, probably sounds... Bro, I think, I think that shit, like... You know how, like, we, like... Like, it's like huffing paint, The brain it's... cells you have, and you get, like, sophisticated brain cells that are kind of like... Yeah. Eh, but it just replaces them. That shit completely shatter-bombed all the brain cells with every you. I believe you, it. Huffing we, paint? We were, still, we were still taking this shit. Wait, was it we paint was or was it, paint. like, uh, cleaner? No, it was. I don't know what the fuck it was, bro. But that shit, that shit was about two dollars a can. That's oh my I, god! That oh, that sounds so oh, bad. Yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah. Will said the fence, bro. We was so fucked up. This motherfucker was like in a Grand Theft Auto style glitch. I'm behind the tree by the fence in Public Park where you can go down the ditch past like the the playground. Yeah, yeah, yeah. By don't the know, um, train there. tracks. I blank out. Yeah, I, I blank out. He's by the fence, by like where the bleachers are, mm-hmm. walking into them on repeat. LJ, LJ, LJ. <laughs> like, like he like, just like, keeps pressing just square and jumping. It. Yeah, and like he's just keeps keeps walking into the fence. LJ, like, oh like, 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 like notebook style. Ryan Gosling. He says brakes. It was brake cleaner, like brakes brake for a car. Cleaner. Yeah, yeah it brake sounds brake. really horrible. Yo, he was like, he had like that was like the first glitch in the Matrix I saw, bro. That shit was. Terrible! Don't ever, don't ever do that, people. For we real. are all old now, don't, so I doubt anybody. Do drugs. I doubt anybody. Uh, I think everybody's already made their mistakes now. That's in our pocket. I hope so. Now in our twenties, thirties, we'd be a little too old now to still be making those kind of mistakes. But yeah, you we never did ever, know. Some people going through hard times, you know. There's nothing left. You know, what I'm <laughs> there's nothing left that most people in here oh didn't try. Oh my God, yo! Remember that time <laughs> we went? Um, we had a party at Springy's. And um, I was selling shroom chocolate bars at the time, and it melted to my phone, and I had to eat it before we went to the party. <laughs> you remember oh, that? Oh, shit, yeah. I, You're like, I had to eat it, I yeah. got stuck there, and we were, like, taking shots of 151 out to bottle me and you. Yeah, that, that was... You oh, were the only one hanging with me. Yo, I think we won tripping. every game of beer pong yeah. that night, too. I'm tripping. <laughs> oh, my God. At 151 days, bro, I used to keep a fifth of 151. Yeah, you did. Bro, I remember the one day... Uh, the one day we're at Nirvana's crib and we had jungle juice mm-hmm. and no one wanted to drink my 151 with me. So I felt offended. I'm like, I'm getting too fucked up off this. I was like, these motherfuckers are going to drink this shit anyway. I was like, so you dipped watch. it in the jungle juice? Bloop, 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 bloop. Oh my God. Pour that shit right in the jungle juice. Before you know it, somebody got caught fucking upstairs. There was going to be a fight. People was getting <laughs> rowdy. The whole party completely changed like an hour and a half. Just yeah, you brought 151 to everything. I remember that. I had my I had my thing. At first, it was the E and J blue label. Then it was the one fifty one, and then it was the then it was the Henny. You know, growth. You know, growth. Financial growth. growth. Financial you know? <laughs> growth. Yeah, you mean AKA you were selling more weed so you could spend more money on alcohol. <laughs> 
He said he broke Willie broke his tooth on a one fifty one bottle. Is that true? <laughs> I think so. I only remember if so. Man. The last time I seen everybody all together in one place was at uh that crib over there by an east side. Well, nah, maybe it's not east side. Over there, no, it's by kind of, but it's kind of east side and Dunmore. That's the last time I seen everybody in the same place together. Remember? Whose crib was it? Uh, I think it was Will's, Jo's, and yours. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. That, That's I the last time there. everyone was like together. That was that was a fun crib to live at. You had one person that wanted everybody over, and one person that didn't want anybody. Over. Yeah, who was? Someone had the one room. <laughs> that was in the between. Someone. I had, I had the I had the fucking trap house room upstairs. Oh, all right. Yeah, I remember. Uh, that was the first time I found out that Jo liked BB King, and I was like, "What the hell do you know about BB King, Jo?" Oh yeah, because the poster. Yeah, yeah I'm looking at him like, shit, bro, yeah. you like, no, you don't know about nothing about no BB King, and he's like, "What, bro? You mad drunk? What? My mom used to put me to sleep to BB King, bro." And I was like, "What, for real?" And he's like, "Yeah, Yo. that's the only thing that would calm me down." I was like, "Oh, wow." Yo, bro, I'm at that crib living living there with them. I'm coming home from work. You know, I never know what to expect when I when I come home when I go home there. But I believe it. Today was different. I go out. Will has his fucking shirt tied on his head like a do rag, <laughs> with shades on that I've never seen before, and everyone's tripping the face on ass all oh fucked my up. God. We eventually wind up going to the store and grabbing this shit called the Kraken, bro. And boy, was it like that shit. You know how they say unleash the Kraken? Yeah. That sh- Got unleashed. We killed oh, no, that. I don't know. Fuck. I never heard of it. <laughs> we, we killed that. It was like spiced rum. It, we killed that shit in like a half it hour. Sounds familiar. Bro, I'm, I'm keeping up with people tripping. Don't know why I'm drinking like that, but I am. But anyways, we kill kill that bottle with like four or five people. Top oh, Damien. Damn. Is that D block, Damien. You don't get drunk on acid though. There's well, no yeah, point to drink saying. on acid because they, you're just wasting. It's like on Molly. You, I, you drink on Molly, you're not doing anything. You're just like still the same you know what i mean until it wears off and when it wears off then you're like oh what the hell i got a headache i'm mad dehydrated bro, bro i'm keeping up with them on acid you know what i'm saying i'm drinking like i'm tripping and i'm not tripping oh. I'm, I'm coming home from work you know what i'm saying if anything the alcohol hits you harder when you come home from work you know what i'm saying yeah, i'm already i don't want to like, be the guy not tripping in the room yeah no it is what it is my, my vibe is always good though so it was i'm basically always tripping yeah, once you take true. the liquid there ain't no turning back anyways yeah that shit, you for life but yo that same fucking day this motherfucker jo he you know how you slide down the rail mm-hmm. and you like sit down like on your ass yeah he was trying to do a version of that like with his like shoulder mm-hmm. and trying to go it did not work missed everything and he fell but he hit um you know like that american water shit like you'll have in front of the crib mm-hmm. that metal thing with that tiniest little metal piece that sticks out yeah he fucking hits that shit bro <laughs> he hit that shit he fucking cracked his head open oh so I'm like I pick his head up. I'm like, oh, shit. I drop his head down for some reason. I'm like, everyone get in the car. I'm like, we got to get him. Oh, Fucking Krishna. God. Me, Will, Jay, and Krishna. That's the only ones left. This motherfucker, Krishna, thought this dude died. And this motherfucker just, um, he he turned around. He walked right up the steps. And he was like, Mm-mm. shaking his head. He was like, hey. he's like, uh-uh. Bro, like, he, like, Jay Oak, like, can drink bro. like I've never seen in my life. Bro, he was leaking blood. He was in my back seat. And he fucking shook up. He was shaking off the blood like a wet dog. <laughs> All in the back seat, that old GMC I had. I bring him to the fucking, yo, we bring him into the hospital, yo. Mm-hmm. He's raised ass to <laughs> Racist ass hospital dude looks at Will. What'd you do to him? He <laughs> <laughs> yeah, automatically blamed Will. Yeah, what'd you do? Huh? Yeah, he was like, he was like, what'd you do to him? <laughs> We're like, yo, he fell. We're like, oh, you guys are doing the underground fight. <laughs> These motherfuckers thought we were doing some fucking Will fight Phil. club and shit. You know, you, we had a <laughs> they had a fight club around their hands. It was fucking <laughs> crazy. That is funny. I, feel bad I think for I Jay bought shrooms off you in that house before because yeah, he, he's drunk, tripping. And now it has a gash in his head. We have no oh idea what's going God. on. Yeah. But that... tra- Who drove? I did. I was oh, the one driving. You were, you were drunk only drunk. Than a mother- <laughs> drunker than a motherfucker. Yo, I'm in the I'm in the waiting room with Will. I'm, well, at least I'm you guys up. weren't Yo. far. Because where yeah, you I'm... were at, that's not far from any of the hospitals where you were at. Yeah, no, it wasn't bad. I'm, t- I'm telling Will, I'm like, Yo, we should have bought the other bottle in here. I'm like, Yo, this shit lit. I'm like, Yo, shorty behind the counter. But... Yo, I'm louder than a motherfucker. I look Mad around. Drunk at the hospital. We're surrounded, talking about we're surrounded by people. You know, legs crossed over. 
They're flipping through the books. I'm looking at my oh, own. We should have brought the bottle to the hospital yeah. to keep yeah, I'm, getting I'm drunker fucked. while our yeah. friend is getting stitches, maybe. All, all types of fuck. We go back to the crib, though. Yo, mm-hmm. Krishna Krishna thinks that he was an accomplice to a fucking murder. This dude. <laughs> but, you know, Yo, I love bro, Krishna, bro. Was, was Yo, him. shout out to Krishna. Oh, he locked our door. We couldn't even get into our house. This motherfucker oh locked us out of our own. Oh, my God. He is so funny, yo. He finally let us in. Yo, this dude, he looked out, though. He hit the grinder. Didn't know where he put it. (laughs) Hit the weed. We were able to find it, and this motherfucker hit the pretzels. (laughs) (laughs) I showed everything I love, yo. He rearranged shit in our refrigerator. Yo, Krishna is something else, bro. I used to always end up with him at the end of the night. (laughs) Getting drunk, just sitting there like, oh, man, I got to (laughs) go. I did go the wrong way. I hit the wrong turn. I had the wrong turn going to the hospital. It was right. Yo, we you're mad back. lucky you didn't get pulled over because the boys be out over that way because well, like... my, my friend, he he was bleeding though, so I had a perfect excuse. I would have you know made up something you know, so I had that's true. Kind of, but you know, still would have gotten in trouble. <laughs> that was my first time ever driving drunk, and I was driving drunk. You know what I'm saying? I was yeah. I was keeping up with people on ass drunk. Yeah, I was super lit. But yeah, that shit was crazy. Christian was like, "Oh, Jail's dead." I'm like, "No, he's not dead." He was like, is he going to make it? He was like, just just tell me. Is he going to make just it? Let me know. He was like, just let me know. So eventually, <laughs> I told, eventually I told him, like, yeah, we just got the call, Krishna. You know what I'm saying? Because he, he wouldn't believe it. He like he just, he was hell-bent on, you know, he witnessed the murder, and that's what it was. <laughs> like, this dude was, he still might be fucked up from this shit, man. I don't know. <laughs> but he was. What were you guys on, shrooms? This shit. Or acid. Uh, on acid. I said acid. acid. Oh, yeah, that's right. Yeah, acid. I know for a minute they had the deadhead acid around here for a little bit. You know what I'm talking about? The deadhead? You got like the the skull with the lightning bolt going through it. Oh, the Grateful Dead shit? Yeah, yeah, deadhead. Grateful Dead. Yeah, whatever. You know what I'm talking about. (laughs) Yeah, they had that for a little bit. That was some gas. I haven't done it in a long time, though. I don't know how I would do it having kids now. I don't even think. Last time I tripped was the McGregor uh, McGregor, uh, Mayweather fight. Damn, that was a long time ago. Yeah, we, we went on a hike. Motherfuckers got lost too, but I, I got burnt out from acid, bro. You take four hits of liquid acid, it's a wrap. Yeah, I took three on, I I took some three on my moments. tongue and dropped one in my eye, bro. I thought there was no coming back. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? One night I was tripping so hard, I had more visuals in the eye I dropped the acid in than the one that I didn't. And I'm like, oh, this is over. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna be like slick. Yeah, I accidentally dosed like, a bunch tripping. of. Like oh shit! Uh, Sour Patch Kids. I had a guy like put a ten strip on Sour Patch Kids. Didn't even. I was so drunk I didn't realize that he put it all on like four of them or five, and I ate all of them. By the time he was like, "Yo, don't do that," and like it was horrible, bro. I tripped for like two days. It felt like I was so bad, bro. And I was like walking around making deals. Just I was playing Frogger with the street. Like I was trying to get across the street to my house. I couldn't get there because. I was tripping so hard, and some one of my friends found me and brought me across the street. I was like, and he looked like his head was just like a big old milk dud with a worm coming out of it, like an apple. You know, like worms come out of god apples. Damn. Oh my god, it was so those it bothered me for like mad long after I looked at him. Like I could not look at him for like mad long without seeing that sight. <laughs> but yeah, man, Friday. I thought more right. people be live with us, but it's Friday. I understand. We'll get a lot of views tonight, though. A lot of people watch it tonight, for sure. We had, uh, yeah, yeah, no, I think definitely. we had 13, 13 people. Man. Yeah, like that. yeah, my energy's a little messed up because I, you know, where I came from. I wish, I wish I didn't have to do that today. I had to put my dog down, unfortunately. Me me in the back looking like I'm the fucking, uh, the guy that snitches on gangland doesn't help either. What do you mean? Look like I'm too dark. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm not, my face is bad. Yeah, dark. it was people over there. You came right, over yeah. here. Uh... I was in the gang for three years. <laughs> I was in the gang for 13 years. I used to just get on the motorcycle at first yeah. and, you know, deliver the, deliver the meth. Man. For real. Look like I got the hidden identity in the back. That, that could that, That's not helping either. Look yeah, like I'm was, telling on MF-13 tough, or some man. shit. <laughs> That funny. show was funny. They would like they would use like regular slang and then stop the whole show, and then like the typewriter effect would come on. You know, it would tell you what it was. Oh, yeah. Put it. We like oh, we were putting in work. And it would stop putting in work. <laughs> and then go fucking define that shit at the bottom. That shit used to be hilarious. Oh man. Word. Where you got any topics though, Vic? I, I know we just we nah. basically must wing, wing nah, the whole I shit. Had to, I had to do that with my dog. It was horrible, but you yeah, know, I got right. through it. 
It's gonna be. What's his name again? Chapo. Recipes to El Chapo, man. I got like his uh his dog chain. I, I'm gonna put it on my keychain, and then I got like his uh a paw print of him. It's horrible, bro. I had to sit. I I I'm, I sat there with him until he died, man. Yeah, that shit sucks, bro. <sighs> Still that tough, bro. I got. Still tough for me right now, man. We got Jay in the building. What's good, Jay? Long time no see. Who, Jay Gans or who? Dirt. Well, we got 12 people now. Everybody's coming now. Why does everybody... Yo, bro, I'm about to just start going live at 8.15, bro. Because this is when everybody comes. Is at 8.15 when I'm a <laughs> NFL and we're getting ready to wrap it up. I'm like, damn, now I got to go for 10 more minutes, 15 more minutes to keep it going. Last time, I literally went for an hour and a half or almost... Because it just kept growing right at the end. Right. More people, more right. people. And I'm sitting there with BJ like, damn, 18 people are in. And we're just talking about wrestling, like WWE. You know what I mean? Oh, well, yeah, I remember that. Yeah, yeah. yeah, I was, yeah I was, you were in there. Was there the and bro, mad people just Definitely. kept coming. And that's when we got to 22. I was Word. like, damn. Oh, what up, cuz? I remember, remember uh, Jay in here, too. I remember we did, I did a fucking, we did a song together. Yeah, back bro. In the day. Me, me and Christian and him, got uh, lost him together at the end of the night. We always ended did, up somewhere uh, crazy. Ambition remix. That Wale ambition shit, me, him, and PJ. Oh, you, bro, uh, team South, we did a um, did a remix to the shit. Oh, where? So it's actually like, yeah, shout out to that's team, man. I had like a I had like a feature I had like a feature in my fucking closet. Yeah, like you don't week. remember me and Team Literally. did our first song together in your closet. It was just me and him. That For real? if yo bitch leave with me, then I bust and got bottles on oh, deck. Shit. Now yeah, we yeah. not front and niggas oh, got wow. opinions. So say something. So say oh, I remember that shit. You're right, you're right. He killed that. We taking over. This is my year. I'm on my buzz. Just call me my light year. year. I, he oh. said, never showed them my pain. Never showed them my tears. We got them denim check. We call them night gears. Real niggas. I, I think I'm singing it right. Yeah, they know what's up. They could, I could tell they with me from the way they show me love. Boy, I remember that shit. So rock I did like, I did like five songs with fucking team back in the day. I think I got, we did a couple I think I only songs. got that one. But we always wanted to do mad more songs together. Actually, I just met, hit hit him up recently, and he like before even like because I heard he got signed with them, but like before his signing, I literally hit him up like a week before, like, yo, bro, I need, I need a team Sal feature, and he was like, I'm with it, bro, no questions. You know what I mean? I had a bunch of people do fucking features in here. A lot, of, a lot of people that were like starting out back, you know what I'm saying? They didn't have like a, there wasn't like a lot, a lot yeah, of studios, you know what I'm saying? Back in the day. Yeah, a, a, a bunch of a bunch of people, you know what I'm saying? Not like everybody, but most people up, that I Dex? knew, you know what I'm saying? That rap wound up fucking doing a feature, a solo, doing something, some type of music in there. Yeah. Or if not, we motherfucker just got high and played 2K or some I shit know, like that. I know, bro. That was always you know our saying? downfall. This, this is why I always try to tell yeah. people when you have a studio, it's way different than going to a studio because then you yeah. have the studio. You think you can slack. You think that you can just be like, oh, I'll just nah, do the song and like, uh, later. Later never happens. You have to do it then. I always try. That's like how I changed my whole like work ethic. Like I'll click mm -hmm. something in my head and I'm like, instead of doing it later, I'm like, oh, no, I'm going to get it done now. You know what I mean? That's just no, how facts. I get things done now. Yeah, that's... that 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 PlayStation controller is not a pen and pad, and that bowl is not a microphone. <laughs> that's 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 where I fucked up a lot too. Thanks. I had some productive too. You know, what I'm saying it's good to you know have it like a balance, but yeah, it, it just wasn't oh, working. Yo, bro, deep. Were you on that one song with me? Um, how did it go? I'm pretty sure you were. Uh, I can't. I can't. Let me see if I can find it on my uh, SoundCloud real quick. I think you're on it with me. Hold up, my SoundCloud. We have 15 people just in now. I think the half of them, five left or something, but I don't know. I can't tell right now. Because I'm going to check go. this. Let's see. Let me check. Where, used to, where Jose? I used to watch Mad Wrestling too. I was, yeah, bro. Wrestling I used to go shit, crazy man. for this shit. Like, I used to, like, no homo. Like, I used to, like, you know, like, wrestle Party with my brother like, and shit uh... like that. You know what I'm saying? I used to like we used to like we used to like fuck each other up, bro. Like for real. Yo, bro. When I, I like I, it was a rap. When I lived like, in like, Archibald for a little bit. Cross, we used I used to, to do the crippler cross other. face and the ankle lock. That was my shit. Oh, yeah, where you thought you were lock. Chris Benoit? Yeah, basically. <laughs> well, not, not, I like not Chris Jericho better personally. You know. Yeah, my, my favorite was still under, Undertaker. You know, oh, you're an Undertaker fan. Yeah, of course, bro. I that motherfucker. I liked everybody. That motherfucker come out of everywhere. Like Bob Tom, Bob Tom. Oh, he, he was looking at his hand. No, he was looking at his hand like that. he wiped and got shit on his fingers. He's. He <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> he Here, let me shit. see if I find it. 
Bro, I've been watching wrestling so long. I remember Booker, Booker T had like his family in wrestling. Yeah, his brother I used to like, wrestle. Stevie. Oh, Ray. it was like Stevie J, Stevie right? J. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Stevie Ray. Yeah, work. Sound like a rapper or some shit. Let me see. <laughs> yeah, you are on it. What's the name of it's it? It's called Let's Be Friends. And the hook was like, Where the hell you been in? Who's your sex? Oh, okay. Friend? Word. Yeah, yeah. Shit, but sometimes Bobby, fuck your can. Yeah, forget your can. Naked pick. Sent. Oh my god, goddamn sex on the high scent. That was like me. Oh, okay, her, word. her and her the night was such a blur. Good pussy was the medicure that Molly Def was extra pure. Her on me, yeah, zer his swagger, no measure. Pimp and shorty, no feather. Remember when I met her, she clown me like a jester. Now she run back, Hester. Like that shit, I went hard on that joint. You were like, who in the girl? Something. Uh, some I'll make it disappear. How the hell did you go? It? How'd it go? Oh, yeah. Fuck. I yeah, got we'll money. Make it, dis- make it disappear? Yeah. Got a lot on your mind. My dick will make it disappear. Yeah, some magic. shit like that. My dick will make it some, like Matt. Yeah. You, you rap fast on it, so it's hard to remember. Yeah, I usually don't. Yeah. It. It was like, I couldn't do that then because I, 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 I was mean, smoking a pack a day. Mm-hmm. I'm, I'm a little yeah. heavier than I was then, but I don't smoke cigarettes, so I got more breath now. She starts winding. I used to like... So, um, then. He said, no Dutch money, something. Ah, oh, I can't remember it. Oh, I remember a dollar menu. No yeah, the dollar <laughs> menu. <laughs> no fine dining. Yeah, it's still the same. Yeah, <laughs> he said, still the same. Ain't nobody <laughs> getting no money. What up, Unc? He said, y'all ain't getting a dime from me. Y'all eating off the dollar menu, and it's not even a right. dollar anymore. So you, you better only get a you double. Lie. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> two, for, two for three, you know, pick two. That's how you know if she's a real one. You know what I'm saying? If you get her a two for three, I still call her back. Oh, yeah, that's right. I go to the restaurants now. Too much, when you know he's got saying? the five for five. Oh, yeah, and the four for four, too. Yeah, yeah it's facts. lit. And that's a lot, Hell bro. Yeah. That'd, be, that'd be filling me up, and I'm a grown man. Yeah, well, I'm not going to front. My nephew, be, I'd be sneaking one for myself sometimes. <laughs> we get two for four. Two four for four, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Oh, my God. I wish they had that shit when I was fucking smoking. No, bro. When I was a kid, I used to. Man, I remember I used to have five dollars. It would be like me and Will. We used to budget that shit. Like, all right, let me get a chili. We used to be able to do so right, much with five dollars, bro. I used to. I used to bring like two friends with me, and go to Wendy's with five dollars. Some motherfuckers right? would sit down like it was like a feast. Like all, you right, bo- all three of you get, get a burger and then you get fries and then dump the Yo, fries used in the to, middle. Times is so fucked up. I remember uh, uh, when me and Will would go there. We would ask them for a cup of water with lemon. And then put sugar in there from the condiment station, stir that bitch up. And make lemonade. Motherfuckers have lemonade. Yeah. <laughs> Word. When life hands you I used lemon. to go there with mom. You know, mom, my mom's my mom's white. She's Italian, but she used to be doing some ghetto shit. She'd be like, oh, when you go there, grab some forks. Like, grab some forks. <laughs> grab some forks. <laughs> grab, 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 grab some That's of the funny. stuff. I, I used to grab that shit too. I'm like, all right, let me grab, let me grab a couple of these, bring them back, <laughs> get some of the them. silverware. <laughs> Word. You getting any new tattoos? Or do you even have tattoos? Yeah, yeah, I just got the um, this hoodie's type tight, so you probably can't, probably can't roll it up all the way. You know the sacrifices big people make to wear nice shit. <laughs> but nothing comes in our size. You know everything is medium and thirty eight. Medium, but, yeah. medium. That's what I call it. I ain't no medium anymore, bro. I'm, I'm a large. Well, you know it's now. different now. though. now, now it's different. You know three X's back in the day used to everyone wore baggy shit, so a three X was lit. Yeah. Now the motherfuckers will try to con you on some shit. Like, I was talking about it's a three X slim fit. Like I know what y'all <laughs> trying to do. It. Fuck, ain't no three X slim fit. <laughs> there ain't no such thing. I, I still, I still got that the the scorpion. Oh word. Shit, shit for Scorpio. I want to get um. Oh I'm word. Gonna, I got my cancer joint right here. I'm gonna get the right I'm gonna get here. the universe coming out of the tip of the jaw. Oh, that's and what's then up. And then it's gonna go up and go up into a whole sleeve. Yeah, that's dope. Oh, well, what up, Bobby L? Bobby Lashin. Yeah, man. Oh, Rob was good. I got... Let's see. I got a lot of tattoos, kind of. Probably since you last seen me. I don't know. <laughs> it's hard to show <laughs> on, the, on the screen. I got... No, you definitely tatted. I remember when we first met you, had like two or some yeah, shit like two. that. And I got all this. I need to link up with a good fucking tattoo artist, too. I, I got my one shit from, uh, from Jake, but I don't know if he's... I don't think he's doing them anymore. <laughs> Jake, that boy, yeah, he he uh he's he's uh doing the, oh, the tree God. shit, yeah, yeah he's doing Jake. the tree shit. 
Yeah, I'm not really Google, cool with dude. that guy. <laughs> the tree, the tree shit, and all that. Uh, uh, that's what gave me. That's what gave me this tat, though. I, I'm probably gonna go to. Through, I want to get one off of. I'm probably gonna go to. Normally, I'm probably gonna go to um George, but I do. I definitely want to get one off of Tommy Hazelton, bro. Just because of all his work, bro. He's got. He's the best artist in the area to me. I've seen like three. He's the, he could do three D tattoos and stuff like that, bro. His portraits yeah, that, are that's nice. Hard. Like. I definitely want to get one from him, man. Well, if you have any tattoo artists are listening and they pop in, y'all know somebody that could potentially have the universe come out of a scorpion tail and go into some he other can shit. Do that, bro. And work on he work on that. somebody over the course of like a year. I'm telling you. Send them my way because I'm definitely with it. That, he could do that. Tommy Hazleton, he could do that. So what I want to do, I want to have this side like light and this side dark. You know what I'm saying? Like oh, all the course. good things in my life yeah. and the good things in the universe and all the dark things in my life and the dark things in the universe. What up, Melissa? Of Some course. fire shit. Of course. Everyone wants to do that. Okay. I had plans on doing that, but then like my arms just went like completely different. Like I got an angel up here. I got Darth Maul, Tweety Bird, Morpheus, uh, Simba, a baby girl monkey, um, a killer a clown that looks like he's going to kill everybody in the room um yeah i got 24 so yeah i just like started throwing like this whole arms for like my whole family and everybody i know you know what i mean Word. so i have just mad different things and this is all native american type stuff you know what i mean so tribal but and then i got my whole neck for scranton the 570 the uh, Electric City joint. That shit hurt. That shit hurt. Wow, my neck right here. Yeah, yeah, definitely. It had to hurt. Yeah, they hurt. They all they all hurt on my neck. Yeah, this that one shading for me was a bitch. My first one wasn't that bad. Andres did it, but it wasn't horrible. But it hurt. Like it didn't hurt until I think I smoked. I smoked a blunt, and then I was like, Ooh. it hurt real bad after. And then I like, I don't like smoking when I get tattoos, bro. I hate it. I won't. Like, no, that's it. Well, I got the tattoo. He, cause you know he he did everything, and then he sprayed the shit on it and then wiped it off. I thought that shit was done, and then he was like, "All right, time for the shading." Bro, my skin was so fucking looks. sensitive. What up, Guillermo? Well, that shit, when they get shaded, that shit hurt like a motherfucker. I want to grab. I want to get a bunch though. You know what I'm saying? I want to get a sleeve and yeah. put a bunch of random shit. I got a machine. The, the sleeve. Like I could start doing them on myself if I wanted to, but. I don't know, bro. What I can't be a rapper, a podcaster, and a tattoo artist. That'd be too much, bro. Yes, you could. Just do the tattoo people and rap on the podcast. That's so hard, bro. <laughs> and be a dad? Nah, bro. It's you're already, already you're hard. Got, you already got the in. mic. Huh? You know what I'm saying? You already got the mic. Yeah, I got two have the kids. Have the kids learn how to make a beat and give a tattoo. And then you, you fucking lit, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Man, being a freaking parent, bro, is so tiring. It really is. I can't lie. <laughs> like, I love it. I'll never change it. But, man, whoo. It definitely gets, like, like I used to be, like, we're, team we're no sleep, bro. Up. Now I'm, like, team I have to take, like, I have to go to sleep because they're going to be up at the crack of dawn, like, straight up, bro. Being a parent's hard. Team no no sleep. You know, your team no no I sleep. I still don't sleep, bro. Even though I try right. so hard, I still can't fall asleep. Bro, bro. I fall asleep at 2 o'clock in the morning and I'm up at 8 a.m. Like, all right. Like, with no work off, you know what I'm saying? Nothing to do. I'm up at fucking 8 a.m. Like, okay. I usually don't fall asleep to 3, Sucks. and my kids got me up at 6.37. Sheesh. Yeah. So I'm like... I'm not even a parent, but shout out to all the parents. Bro. No. Bro, you know, that shit's, tired, that shit's hard, hard for kids, man. Especially in these days and ages, you know what I'm saying? It's different. You know, it's... I mean, like... Shit's more expensive. School yeah, system's more diapers, fucked up. bro. And then, you know that as they get older, that diapers become less in the thing? Okay, all right, but yeah, did you know as they get older, like say um, you, they're in a size two. There's like 180 diapers. Then when they're in a size three, it's 172 diapers. So it gets lower and lower the older they get. I see what you're saying. It's same stupid, price bro. and everything. But yeah, yeah, same less, price but less diapers. Right, right, less diapers. Bro, right. you never get a break, bro. <laughs> But yeah, I wish everybody was uh, talking to us. Was good with you, Guillermo. I mean, it was. 
It was pretty on. It was, it was pretty active when we was talking about a bunch of yeah. other shit earlier. Yeah, everybody's uh, enjoying their Friday. You know how it is. Friday is something else, bro. Yeah, it's the Friday going up to you know thanks uh, Thanksgiving. Who the fuck am I? Easter and shit. Because some people don't go out. Yeah, you know was, what I'm saying? Huh? You know, you know the old heads. You know the old heads always be out for Easter. You know what I'm saying? All the old heads be out for Easter. Easter. Oh man. Bro, all these pagan holidays, people really don't understand that, like, all these holidays are pagan holidays. And they think it's, like, Christian, but it's really not. You know what I'm saying? I'm pretty sure they're all pagan. But, I mean, Easter is supposed to be for Jesus coming back to life. Yeah, and telling everyone to hide the eggs. I know, I always think of that freaking like, <laughs> um, Carlos Mencia commercial, yeah. too. Jesus is back, hide the eggs. <laughs> You got yo. I remember my aunt used to have a fucking egg hunt back in the day, yo. When they used to tell us to go, I was ready to knock a kid over for that motherfucking egg, cause one of them shits used to have five dollars in that shit. So I was, I was ready. I was like, I'm getting that shit. I remember the Easter egg hunts and all that shit. Yeah. Fucking. What is that? One shit. Man. Someone just commented. I think it said, uh. Oh, I thought George. I thought it said George commented. He liked it. Yeah, man. Easter, I oh, got a, yeah, I know, man. All money in the eggs. Man. It's a weird holiday, bro. My daughter's yeah, back... one, my son's two, about to be three, so they, what, what, can, what much can you really do for him at that age? You know what I mean? My son could do a lot, yeah. kind of, but, like, my daughter's one, I can't even really give her that much candy. So. That's true. Fucking dress up as the Easter bunny, you know? Yeah, I, I got convinced this that. motherfucker was real because I was, like, I was, like, six or seven. I'm staring at that motherfucking table the whole time. I'm like, I'm a catch this motherfucker, you know what I'm saying? Oh, the Easter Bunny? Uh, yeah, you know, I was a smart little kid. I'm like, you know, I'm like, Santa, you know, Santa on his shit. It's hard to get him, but like, I'm going to get this motherfucking Easter Bunny. Santa's on And then I, I must have wound up falling asleep. You know, I never did that as a kid. I never sat with my eyes open until I fell asleep. That shit literally happened. So, boom, I dozed off, fell back asleep, woke up, and there's candy on the table. I'm like, this motherfucker is real. I'm like, this motherfucker got me. This motherfucker <laughs> put me out and just put this shit in here. Who is it, Santa? E uh, the Easter Bunny and the Tooth Fairy. Those were all the, the things that we believed in as kids, man. I don't even, yeah, it's going to be crazy having to like do that for my kids. You know what I mean? Having to, re uh, have to introduce them to all these things. It's so weird being a parent. But yeah. LJ's clotheslines kids for them $5. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, man. Facts. WWF style. Man. That was... Fucking J.R. Lawler, you see me in the background. Oh, Bro, you know he's God. racist? Who? J.R. J uh, the King. You know he's racist? I thought he passed, oh, he passed away, too. Anyway. No, he, he didn't away. pass away. The King? Yeah. No. Yeah, bro. No, I'm... Years ago. Jerry the King Lawler? No. Yeah, bro. He passed away like five years ago. I believe so. No way. He ain't dead. Yeah, does anybody in here know J.K. Nah, he ain't dead. King Lawler, he died. Did he die? No. Yo, you looked it up? Yeah, I'm looking at it right now. He ain't dead. <laughs> oh, shit. One, one of the announcers passed away. Or maybe that was like the was a Twitter host. Was it No, JR's on AEW now. The one that's like, he, no, no, he's no. so big, you can't even tell his mouth's moving. He's like, oh, my God. Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> you look like a chicken. <laughs> like <Word>. a gobbler. <laughs> it goes like straight forehead to chest. Like, yeah, like yeah, straight up, bro. It went right. Like, like, yeah. <laughs> this is all bluff, bluff. Yeah, yeah, That's my guy, sure. though, yo. I liked him. Yeah, he's on um, AEW now. So's the Big Show, but he's called Paul White. Wow, the Big Show's still doing shit. God damn, yeah, bro. Well, it's the Big Show. Word, that that was a big motherfucker though, too. Well, it's the big man. Yo, he's so slept on. What kind of Native American am I? I am Chippewa, Cherokee, and Iroquois. And my dad's part is the Iroquois is part of the Nottaway tri tribe, which is kin to Pocahontas, which is the Potahantaway tribe. So, yeah. I'm very Native okay. American in black and yeah. white. So I could tell everybody, F you. You all gotta love me. I like everything. <laughs> Chicken. Mayonnaise, all that. But yeah, man. Damn, it's already eight thirty-four. I can't For believe real? it. Yeah, it goes by fast, man. You be on here talking, and then you be like, "Damn, it's already been an hour." 
Yeah. yeah we, didn't, we didn't have a lot tuned in that once, but the, the comments was definitely lit, though. Yeah. That's all right. We'll definitely... We'll get a lot of... um. Wait, did it stop? Nah. We still live. No, right? no, I'm, no, yeah, no, because I'm watching it. I got it on my, I got it on my phone. Cause I can't right. see, I can't see the, I can't see the comments or anything unless I do that. We're bro. gonna be able to see it. Not nah, people will watch it. You know what I mean? It's just it's Friday. A lot of people probably busy doing their thing. Ah, that's okay. Yeah, next time, next time if I if I jump when I when I jump on here again because I know I'm gonna be on here again. I need to, I need to work on some better type of lighting because <laughs> depending depending on uh, uh, science. And my lighting isn't isn't working the best. Yeah, I hear that. Yeah, I got my uh, little ring light, so I have everything set up. But you know, I'm actually yeah, doing a podcast, so I have to. right, right. Yeah, it's different, but still, like I said, I'm back here like the motherfucker on Gangland or the news. Yeah, right. Where they try to conceal their identity. <laughs> it you was know, him. Like the, yeah, the witness that doesn't want to be named <laughs> is going to speak. They'd be like, "Oh, I was in the gang for four years. Like, I look like I'm that fucking look like I'm that fucking he guy. He did this. He did that. Yeah." <laughs> I need to, I need to, I need to work on the lighting a little bit. Oh, man, look like I'm, I'm in the uh, dark. Next, oh, one of these episodes, I'm gonna have it so uh, I have two people on, man, because I can call two people on Skype. You know what I'm saying? And have oh, two you can do that. On. Yeah, I could have four people on, bro, if I wanted. Oh shit! Or I think there three, three plus me, so it'd be four all together. You know what I mean? So that would be. Lit. I'll try one of these times, but then we'll all be talking over each other. I feel like. Yeah, that'll be that'll be at, sip. Uh, you said that, hey, what about? Exactly. It'll be like that the whole time. Should be. I used to have that shit in um, in Zoom calls when I worked at uh Duncan, the, the motherfucker. Oh. The managers never had that shit organized, so we had to have it to the point where they just muted everybody. Oh yeah, like oh you have your the, mic before yeah. Yeah, people would have to raise their hand to speak and shit because everyone just talking over each other and shit like that. Yeah. Yo, those Zoom calls back being a manager back in those days, those Zoom calls were fucking treacherous. Or fucking no, because no one knew how to use that shit. You know what I'm saying? Everyone, yeah, everyone, everyone just on the fly had to start learning how to. That you still work there when um campus. COVID first started. You're saying, right? Yeah, I was there. I was I got hired in 2019, like October, so I was there for a little bit, and then COVID happened. That place went upside down. That place is like a only drive through, bro. It was like the Walking Dead out there. Motherfuckers were out. Motherfuckers are in front of our door, like let us in, let <laughs> us in. That shit was that shit was wild. Bro, my thing is saying like four different things. It's saying 14 people, 15 people are watching. Then it says seven people are watching. I don't know. It's confusing. But yeah, yo, we definitely have to um put when uh the, the song drops, you have to put it in the comments here, bro. Yeah, you know yeah, no mean? fact. We'll come back into it, right? And uh, tag it into the comments for this. Facts, exactly. Or, it's going to be posted, you know what I mean? And then I'm going to post or, it on my YouTube, and then I'm going to post it on... The five seven zero live page, you know what I'm saying? Well, yeah. Well, I'm gonna um, I'm gonna I'm gonna bust that shit down in um iMovie, and I'm uh, I'm uh, populate it onto YouTube, so we at least have it like that, because the, the distro kid taking a little bit longer, because I don't have all my shit set up like that yet. Oh uh, yeah. So it takes a little bit longer to get put onto the platform, but I yeah. want to keep that, cause, you know what I'm saying? That's how you get that's how you get the money, you know what I'm saying? That's basically sure. like having like a record label. I actually you know didn't check my distro kid screen. money. I ain't checked my money on there in a minute. I probably Might got rich, like dog. a couple of some some bucks up in there. There you go. Real. Yeah. Yeah, I'll be That's dropping an album though. soon. I'm just confused on what I'm gonna name it. Yeah, no. I'm, I'm, Speaking I'm, of 11, Mara, Mara. Eleven seventeen. Eleven seventeen is definitely coming out before the uh, before like the actual summer. Well, we're in April. That shit's gonna be out before June. So all right, it's, all right. it's not uh not soon, but yeah, not, not back never. On around that time. Yeah. Eleven seventeen is basically a. It's gonna be the most me I've ever been. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You know I'm older now. I don't do a lot of shit, so now it's gonna be more uh more reflective than anything. The world and you know chill. What I'm saying? Yeah. yeah. I see that. That type of shit. Some shit you could bop to, cry to, relate to, depending on what track you listen to, party to when they listen to ours. You know what yeah. I'm saying? Or laugh oh. at a girl that you know is dumb that can't get a car started. <laughs> They'll know what that means when they hear it, but you know. <laughs> Yeah, man, I don't know what I'm gonna do with mine, but it'll be out eventually. I might name it Moon Dog Twenty Four. Thinking, I don't know, man. I need, I need a feature, you know. I need a feature. For what? Oh yeah, of course. But see, I'm gonna try to get like you on a feature. Or I'm gonna do like the like with somebody else. We'll probably try to make the song still short, but try to get two features on it. I want to get like a bunch of different people. I want to get people that normally want to do a song together. You know what I mean? I. Right. So like, oh, well, what I eventually want to do once uh 
once I get some form of a buzz back or even some some momentum, once I get the uh, the ball rolling, I want to do what Tech Nine used to do back in the day. Oh, a lot of people have regular yeah, album. No, yeah, if they ever had like a tech, if you ever bought an old school Tech Nine album, yeah. you would have the whole Tech album, and then there would be like a there would be bonus tracks or even oh, a bonus word, CD, yeah. and it would have his it would have um people that he fucks with well, on no there. No one buys CDs and, anymore. That's the yeah, problem. yeah, but you know, yeah, that's the only thing. Yeah, <laughs> so I'm you would just fuck, be having you know? like it on. Uh... You'd have to sell it like on iTunes and then have Bro, last, like an last extra... time I was successful with music, I was fucking, you know what I'm saying? I was, it was nickel and diamond mixtapes. I know. Bro, that I... shit worked though. Cause we were, yeah, we went to, we had to get the, we printed out the covers ourselves with photocopy paper and fucking staples oh, and man. then got paper cutter and then individually burnt like 200. The CDs. Yeah. And put the cover into each mixtape and had each mixtape cover. So literally that entire thing was made from scratch. The, uh, that um, um that born winners uh mixtape was fucking that's what's crazy up, though. That's the hustle right there. That's when when you do that, you the good things start happening because you're putting in the effort. You know what yeah, I mean? Yeah, it was it was different. You know, the my not that I lost the energy from it, but you know, it started getting to that age where fucking what you got to do and what you want to do, like that fucking those Facts. pathways just started fucking narrowing. You know, and then, yeah. so everybody. Anybody that rap back in the day and still doing that shit now, you know, big shout outs to you. Facts. Keep the energy, momentum, and consistency with that oh, shit. Yeah. That shit that shit is not easy. No matter who you got in your corner, you know what I'm saying? Don't let anybody tell you that, you know. Real. You can't real. do something because you can now, do whatever you want. Because you know what happened? People will fall off for some shit and then be bitter. You know what I'm saying? Oh, other people you know, do some shit. You gotta, you know, you gotta push for people regardless. You know what I'm saying? Somebody's yeah. gonna make it out. Of the city. Well, people already are making it out of the city, but somebody's gonna make it out this motherfucker and be on MTV. You know what I'm saying? Eventually, Grammy. You know what I'm saying? Shit like that. You know Somebody. what I'm saying? I'm gonna turn on YouTube one well, day. John Legend like... did play piano, I think, at the Shiloh Real. Baptist Church. Watch, I'm telling you. Watch, one day we're gonna turn on YouTube and like one of those ad videos. That shit's gonna be like Team Cell or somebody from like right. um, um Sour City. It's gonna be somebody like that. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Facts. And turn on YouTube and see them on that shit and be like, oh shit, word. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Shit, maybe one day it might even be me, but the the, the chances for that aren't aren't as that high because I <laughs> I, I have nothing. You know what I'm saying? That's right. why I'm debating on putting that shit on YouTube because literally when I put that track on YouTube, that's gonna be the only video on the channel. You know what I'm saying? That's so, all right. You but got you got to start. You know, yeah, no yeah, content. Some content's better than no content. That's yeah, why we're no, here right no. now because I just said screw it and started putting content out, bro. So you yeah, know, no, it's you. starting to get it's starting to get some traction. So I got 400 yeah. likes in the last video, 450. The one before that I had 550. So, but yeah, let me get uh get up out of here. I gotta go take care of these kids. Yeah, so they gotta you gotta do daddy shit, husband shit. Yeah. Sounds like you're you're late. You sounds like you're getting late on both. So like, yeah, yeah I got the word. <laughs> but I appreciate everyone for uh tuning in to five seven zero live episode six. Facts. Yes, sir. everyone appreciate y'all. Y'all have a happy everybody. Easter, man. Facts. Yeah, for real. I won't Thanks see you, I think, support, till, man. Yeah, till Monday. So have a happy Easter, everybody. Enjoy it with your family. Hide the you eggs. Know, stay, out of, stay out of the mix. You know what I mean? I'll see you guys on Monday. You dig? All right, Peace. everybody. Peace.